Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, we are going to model this pipe elbow using Creo Parametric. Just go to software, new, we are going to model as a solid modeling part, part modeling, just this part modeling, untick this use default template, just click OK. Now we are going to use mm as a unit mm newton solid part absolute method just click ok just view your planes now just go to the model now i'm going to extrude this section the length of 19 the inner diameter is 25 and outer diameter is 32 just go to model select the front plane sketch sketch view first draw the center line press roller to confirm now just go to circle with the center point just choose the center point and press then again center point and press press roller to confirm now our inner diameter is 25 just change into 25 and the outer diameter is 32 change into 32 now just go to fit screen now we have done our section then just click ok to confirm now just go to extrude just rotate your uh, model by using your center roller now our, our extrusion direction is this side now our extrusion length is 19 change into 19 just press enter now just click ok to confirm now just go to the pier now we have done this section now we just want to model by using sweep just go to the model again now choose this plane middle plane go to sketch sketch view now we just want to take references for our sketch go to reference take this as a reference this one and this one also just close go to arc center and ends now we just want to choose our center this is our center this is one of the end and this is second end now press roller to confirm now we have uh, model our path to extrude just click ok now just go to here sweep now it has taken origin as this one where the direction is there that is the origin it has taken this origin now we just want to make the section to sweep just go to sketch here sketch view so this is the point where we just want to make section cross section drawing here you can see this point so just go to circle just go to our model here our external diameter is 32 but inner diameter they, they are not given but inner diameter is little bit lesser than uh, 25 so that is we are going to give ourselves just go to the model just click the center click ok then again click the center click ok then press roller to confirm now our extra diameter is 32 then our inner diameter is lesser than 25 but little bit little bit lesser i'm just giving 23.5 i have taken 1.5 so just click ok now you can see our model is sweeped along the path just click ok to confirm then just go to the figure up to this we have model this is we just want to do by using extrude same 25 and 32 and 19 mm just go to the model select this surface go to sketch sketch view Take the reference of outside diameter 
just close now go to the circle with center point click the center point then click this outer outer diameter then again click this inner and don't mess with the inner diameter just click here and click the roller to confirm now the inner diameter is 25 now press click ok to confirm now we have model our cross section we just want to extrude this section into 19 mm just go to extrude this extrusion length is 19 press enter just click ok to confirm now just go to here standard orientation just rotate your object is you have done a correct model to check that go to view sectional view any section you just choose just change change the direction to check your section now x direction now you can see now we have model the correct one correct model so just click ok this is the cross section of cut section of our model to add it just select this one just right click and delete just click ok to view the appearance just click this one same select this any one and part click ok Now we have model our elbow, pipe elbow. Thank you for watching my videos. Please subscribe my channel for more videos. And if you have any other easy method to draw the same component in cryo parametry, please comment here.